I will be involved in uh, two pieces. I will conduct two pieces. The first piece I will conduct is uh, a piece by the French composer Paul Vica, L'Apprenti Sorcier. And this is being transcribed for a Chinese orchestra, so it's quite a, quite a chance. And the arranger, he really did a, a, a great job. And then my second intervention will be the world creation of my own composition called The Halloween Dances. Well, since, since I was a, a young composer, I was always interested in uh, ethnic instruments, non-Western instruments. And myself, I, I have a collection over, of over 800 different ethnic instruments because I think a composer is always looking for new inspiration. And in my case, I was trying to find new sounds. So therefore, when I was conducting in uh, Hong Kong in 2005, conducting the, the, the uh, symphony orchestra here, I saw a poster and I saw Hong Kong Chinese Orchestra. I said, what, what is this? I mean, I want to see it. So I went to a rehearsal. I came in this room and I saw the maestro conducting those wonderful instruments that I didn't know. And I was really impressed. So uh, I had a conversation with the maestro saying that it was really lovely, etc. And we had an agreement that he said, well, if you want to write something for our orchestra. I said, yes, okay. came to Hong Kong two years ago to study the instrument so I was here for one week sitting behind a table just looking in the scores and watching the maestro conducting Chinese music and of course I mean the purpose was to write in my music uh, Western music coming from a Western background but inspired by Chinese music so the result is uh, 25 minutes of, uh, of music so I have two movements. The first movement, it's called the uh, Trick or Treat. So it's all inspired by Halloween. It's the story about the small children making fun. They're ringing at the doorbells and then they run away and they do all kind of, 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 of silly things. And then the second movement is the dance of the blind bats. And the bats only fly during the night. And the children, it's dark, it's full moon, and the children are just walking in the darkness of the night. And they see a very old castle. And the door of the castle had been closed for the last 200 years. So they open the door and you all have that very strange, weird sound. And it starts with the singing of the blind bats. They go like, weep, 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 weep. And when they fly, you hear like, So I was inspired by all those movements. And they go like into a dream. It's like a film. If you listen to the dance of the blind bats, it's really, you see a whole film in front of your eyes. And it's an, I think it's an amazing story. So the people, they will listen to, the, to a, a marriage of a Western composer influenced by Chinese music, but looking through the eyes of a child. <laughs> Thank you. 